in my humble opinion, I think that some of the greatest uh, movies that were done or that will ever be done are behind us. I don't think that things look very bright for film in the future, but I hope I'm wrong about that. But today with everyone being so sensitive and cancel culture, um, I think that you know, this is one of the reasons we keep seeing so many reboots of everything. They're rebooting everything that was done in the 80s and the 90s and 2000s back during a time where you can pretty much say whatever you want it. And in my in my opinion, uh, the more censorship you have, the more that limits uh, people ability to be creative, things they can't do or can't say. So um, even though we're not I'm not reacting to a movie, uh, this is a series that I haven't seen in decades uh, besides a couple of clips. And uh you know, this was before cancel culture. OK, so that's why that's what makes these even more funny. So I can't wait to check this out. We're checking out some Al Bundy today. Let's get into it. Let's go. <laughs> ah. At last. Single with TV. <laughs> pa? Pa? Can I really keep the pig I raised as a pet? Sure you can, son. Now uh, run along and do your chores. <laughs> the boy sure is dumb. <laughs> Who's that boy? Who's the man with the hit you gun? Who's the man who kills for fun? Psycho death. Psycho death. Hit the gun. But he loves his son. Killed his wife because he weighed a ton. <laughs> Psycho dead, psycho dead, psycho dead. <laughs> Sorry, Peg. But I'm gonna have to leave you there as a lesson to other women who don't cook for me. <laughs> Right. Move over. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. That's a, that's the best feeling. <laughs> Al. Al. Leave me alone, Peg. Let's fool around. Go away. <laughs> Please. You know, that doesn't sound like Peg. Pleading got you married, but it's not going to get you. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello. <laughs> Are you going to make me beg? Oh, you will do things, but begging will not be one of them. Daddy! Oh. Daddy? Daddy? It's not what you think. <laughs> it couldn't be. By the way, what the hell are you doing here? I'm sick. I wonder what Psycho Dad would do in a case like that. There, there, Pumpkin. There, there. God, what a day in the shoe store. We had a clearance sale. We had to get rid of all our size 13 quadruple Ds. <laughs> store was packed with women. Well, there were actually only two in the store, but it was wall to wall. <laughs> you know, you'd think, you'd think that women with big fat feet would be slim and beautiful, but surprisingly... <laughs> Daddy, I'm sick. Will you make me some toast? Well, Kelly, you were here all day. 
Couldn't you make some yourself? <laughs> no. You just sat in the dirty tissues. Oh. <laughs> you are your mother's daughter, aren't you? <laughs> Would you mind telling me why you couldn't make some? Isn't it obvious? Because I am sick. And if I touched the bread, then I would get my gerbs on it, and then I would be eating my own gerbs. <laughs> oh, and another reason is we don't have any bread. Well, if we don't have any bread, how can you expect me to make toast? Ah, no. <laughs> Why didn't you call me at the store so I could have picked some bread up on the way home? Isn't it obvious? <laughs> because if I used the phone, then I would be getting gerbs on it. And oh my God! To my own gerbs. <laughs> Come on, give me some bread, Daddy. Wait, I'm just waiting to hear something. <laughs> now I can go. <laughs> Like said, it couldn't get any worse, huh? Except if this was to happen, and Murphy's Law has it. Uh, I just love this, and these jokes hit a little bit even harder when you become a father, you know. So, you know, I used to laugh when I was a kid at these jokes, uh, and now I, I laugh for different reasons now that I'm older. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> Definitely one of my favorite series of all time up there with Seinfeld. Um, these jokes hit even more harder, you know, when you become a father. Uh, I laughed at them when I was a kid, okay? And now I laugh for different reasons now that I'm older. Isn't that, isn't that crazy? So, uh, absolutely love it. It's like seeing it for the first time because I haven't seen this in decades. Uh, I vaguely remember this episode, but I still laugh at it. It's hilarious. Hope you guys enjoy the reaction. If you did, please feel free to like the video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That'll let me know to put out more stuff like this. Feel free to check out my Patreon if you want to support the, the page. There's a lot of content on there that doesn't make my YouTube channel. And I get a lot of my reaction requests uh, from there. Let me know in the comment section below what you want to see me react to next. Hope you guys have a great day. Peace. <laughs>